All right, hi guys, and we're back with more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Last time we started off this chapter of the game where we're breaking into Jinra to go save Aerith, finally. So I see no reason to delay this episode and just keep going. Nobody's home. Yeah. Do you have any idea where they might be holding Aerith? Thinking a research facility. That make the most sense. And where is that? Up of course. Maybe near the top. That's where you are. Maybe. Maybe we can use the console at the reception desk to find out. It's incredible. <laughs> a shiny monument to corporate greed. One of these days I'm gonna tear it down and burn the yard. But not today. Yeah, yeah. No real way in there. You, but I don't think we should try touching it. Shit, making life hard. No duh. Heading up. Just keep going up and up and up and up. So how do we get upstairs? Either the elevator or the emergency stairwell. Isn't the lab we're looking for on one of the top floors? I vote we take the elevator. And we need an authorization key card. No getting upstairs without a key card, huh? Nope. I think we're gonna need a few before this is over. Pretty sure I saw one lying around. The reception desk. Yeah, but God damn it, but how do we get in there? Oh, well, I'm good to know where it is, but... Hmm? Look. Pretty sure oh, there's no ceiling. We're totally Persona 5-ing this. <laughs> I think I'll give it a shot. Huh? You go, Tifa. As the lightest one here, I figure I've got the best chance. You two can sit back and watch. <sighs> oh, we did it! We're finally getting to play as Tifa! Okay, guys. Wish me luck. I called it. I called this a few episodes ago. That we were gonna get to play as Tifa eventually. <laughs> Even if she is kinda auto-controlled right now. Yeah, I'm not moving her around light. I'm only I'm only triggering her jumps. Tifa! Uh, uh. Oh shit! Tifa! Didn't mean to do that, but Are you okay? I thought I was dead for sure. Oh, well there's a chest over here. I mean it's good I found that at least. Hey, two thousand gil. That can be used to buy us a ton of items. Oh, I see. We run up here, and we can get up on this one. Uh. Ew. Tree. Uh. Uh. Go up. Oh, we, oh, we, oh, we crashed Bandicoot our way across. Awesome. At least you're not, like, crashing Raffle Vortex. <laughs> you don't take forever to get across the monkey bar section. Where else can I go with this monkey bar skill? Hmm. Uh... Oh, I can take that ladder upstairs. Okay. I like this. I like this little section where we play as Tifa. I don't like an ex kind of like an exploration dungeon, if you get what I mean. Hand over hand, huh? That's fine. Going and turn nice. And drop. Hey, uh, I think. Uh okay, we need to make our way over there. 
So, if I walk over this way, I can get off here. I haven't explored around here yet. So okay, and then get off over there. Pretty close now. Just need to make it over there. Okay, now drop down. Back on over here. Need to make it over there now. All right, yeah, we need to make it over to where the uh, we need to make it on the other side of that wall. Drop down here, and there is a chest I noticed. No. Oh. Almost there. Just need to get across those platforms. Oh, that's not a chest. That's a wool box. Okay, never mind. That's no use to us. Imagine the toolbox is everything we need to get across. Okay. Okay, and jump! Okay, and we just need to make it from uh, the lights to the... Oof. Oh no, we, we jump onto those lights. And jump. Ugh, nice. Oh, I see. Triangle's making us kick. So go for further. And okay. Build up momentum. And made it. That's some fine work. I might be able to disable security from here. Huh? Ha! Hot damn, girl! But I didn't do anything. Shit, I'll take it. So you can use that to look up what floor the research facility's on? I think so. Give me a sec. Bingo. Professor Hojo's lab. 65th floor, looks like. Huh. Guess we can only get to the 59th floor via the elevators or stairs. To access any level above that, we need to check in at the Skyview Hall reception. 59th floor it is, then. Mm -hmm. Right. Elevator buttons. If Cloud could just stand in front of them. Jeez, Cloud, just like, stop. Going hyper for five seconds. I just stand still in front of the buttons. I can't press them otherwise. Jeez. Going up. Doors closing. So what can we expect further up? Hmm. More security and restrictions. It's not gonna get any easier. Huh? Huh? Tenth floor. Doors <gasps> opening. <gasps> Intruders! <laughs> Fighting time. I appreciate how the other ones just stood there and watched us eat them up. Yeah, I like how this one just stood there and watched us kill the other guy. Like, I'm sorry, good sir. What is wrong with you? Expecting that. Guess so. Anyone knows we're here? Nah, we took him down quick. Going up. Doors closing. Wonder if it'll stop again. People ought to try using the damn stairs sometime. If it happens again, we'll deal with it like before. We got this. <sighs> well, that didn't take long, did it? Be ready for a fight, guys. There we go. Oh yeah, another one in the bag. Nothing happens. Our first key card is required. And no, nothing's gonna happen. I say we just keep going up the elevator. Going up. Doors 
Straight on up to the top now. Come on. We just keep getting way late, don't we? If you want to take the stairs. Now that you mention it, no. Thirtieth floor. <laughs> Doors open. Heads up. Could be trouble. <clears throat> <laughs> it's okay. I'll wait for the next elevator. Normal people work here too. She probably called for help. We're safe here. What about you, Mom? You okay? <laughs> Good. That's a relief. What? Oh, they gotta be kidding. Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. No, we haven't heard anything new yet. But they told us that Avalanche could attack again at any time. Just get somewhere safe, okay? Yeah, about that. Well, that guy's oblivious. A whole lot of normal people with families and friends work for Shinra. People just trying to support their loved ones as best they can. I know it's not exactly a revelation, but it's easy to forget. A good man who serves a great evil is not without sin. He must recognize and accept his complicity. He must open his eyes to the truth that his corporate masters are profiting from the planet's pain. Only then can he redeem himself. I know you know this. I do. Tifa, we need to focus on saving Aaron. I know. I will. Morality will get us nowhere right now. Seventy, eighty, ninety, one hundred percent, one hundred ten. Mako supersaturation confirmed. <laughs> Engaging materia cooling to reduce temperature. God, she has a human foot though. Second core, she does pay. Someone's kink as well, I can just tell. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. <laughs> Mako density and materia integrity are both holding steady. Registering mass increase in core materia. Registered. We're leaving. Material growth accelerating, outpacing models. Registering. He doesn't even get up, he just crawls to her. The reaction is out of control. We have to stop it quickly. Clean up the mess, would you? I'm out. So that guy is totally whipped. There's no way that he's like not doing this for personal enjoyment. Let's look for reception. Updated the visitors pass. You must be here for our grand tour. Visitors have access to floors 60, 61, 62, as well as floor 63. You will proceed in that order. By the exit of each floor, you will find a device that will allow you to update the key card in your possession, thereby allowing you to access the next floor. And now begins your grand tour. Please enjoy the Shinra experience. Why has this whole thing got to be such a big pain in the ass? 
I don't know about you, but this is kind of weird. You think everything's going too well? Yeah, I do. Think this is a trap? Ha! <laughs> if it is, then bring it on. Let's get this party started. Yeah, it does feel like we're getting in a bit too easy. Uh, this is not a vending machine. Okay. Man, why we gotta get all these damn key cards just to get anywhere? This is Shinra HQ. The how did you expect? Says the former company man himself. Guess you know about all the rules, regulations, and red tape. It's like coming home, huh? Yes, every reactor, every pillar. Like I said, a full inspection. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. <sighs> Sorry to bother you, sir. No, it's fine. I have brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir... Perhaps you should try and get some sleep. No, not yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... It's beyond the pale. Director, I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. Don't I know it? Alrighty then. Welcome to the Shinra building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here in the Memorial Museum, you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And of course, the city of Midgar and the miracle of Mako Energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up! That light looks like a key card to me for some reason. I think I just threw up a little. Man, As you would. Very highly of yourself. Hey everybody, how's the grand tour? I hope you're all enjoying yourselves. Wasn't it fun to learn about Shinra and our esteemed president? And to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool. Can you like get on with it please? I remember all these being bosses at one point. Ah, oh, fun times to look back on all the things we've killed so far, so close to the end. Impressive, wasn't it? I hope you enjoyed learning about our divisions. And the wonderful ideas and solutions that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock. Now, Isn't this stuff we kind of already know? Thank you. This is Midgar, our home, recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. A Mako which flows beneath our feet 
is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. The triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies. Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. All right, that's one floor. Congratulations. You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar. Deal. Now, moving along. Next, you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the visual entertainment hall. Welcome to the visual entertainment hall, where we showcase Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience. Please relax and enjoy the show. This place is empty. What the hell? distant past, our planet was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many millennia before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture too has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land, shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we have harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green inverted land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized.
I, I don't think this is part of the show. God damn it, get out of here! No! Sephiroth. Oh dear. Oh dear. A man of my refined taste. Running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> Is Sephiroth no, here? It, it couldn't possibly have been. Crazy ass thing made me want to puke. And not just because of the presentation, but the content, too. Ought to come with a warning. That ain't for kids. That wasn't just a movie. That huge meteor, what was that about? Like I said, nothing you should show a kid. Okay, so that wasn't just Cloud. That was, everyone saw that. Hey, yeah, whatever. Uh -oh. Greetings and welcome, Avalanche, I presume. My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Hmm? I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. The mayor of Midgar? The empty suit that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? Yes. The mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built, that Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the Mayor want with us? I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. Guess we're supposed to follow. You don't really have a choice. So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm? Fancy, you got secret passages in your bookways and all that. can't be this easy. It just can't be. This can't be right. Ah, wonderful. You finally made it. <sighs> I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. Domino, at your service. Oh, I thought he was going to be a tiny little midget. <laughs> I'm disappointed. I must say you three haven't exactly been discreet. Huh? I 
I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. What the hell's going on? Come on, think about it. You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, and scared an accountant half to death. You hear the alarm? No? You're I mean, welcome. she kind of deserved it for going to the elevator and not taking stairs, just hmm. being lazy. I can only assume your cell wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Huh. Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. Yeah, I felt like it was going on a bit too the easy. The greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerd. Those stupid Shinra pricks thought I'd just shut up and accept their treatment. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. Huh. Well, this ought to make things easier. <laughs> we need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. And then we give him his comeuppance. The president's going to get his, too, if I have anything to say about it. Mm. Well, I don't particularly care what you end up doing. So long as it hurts Shinra. Great. Oh, trust so, me, it will. I can get you as far as the 64th floor. Hold up. You're telling me that that's the best you can do? That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian, nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports, that's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. They've made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Hmm. Let me see that key card of yours. Here you are. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! Midgar's mayor is nothing less! Uh. Everyone says he's cooler than the rest! Just say, Mayor, to the guy, and if he goes, the best, with gusto, then you found your man. You got it? Feels like a goddamn goose hunt. Fine. Go. I still can't believe the Mayor is working with Avalanche. Would have been nice to know. Idiots at HQ should have kept us in the loop. So, about this precious promised land of yours. Come now, Aerith. You misunderstand my intentions. I wish only to satisfy their material greed, so I can be left to pursue my great work. Our great work, my dear. Hmm. You're the spitting image of her now. I regret it to this day. If she had only trusted me instead of trying to run, it could have played out quite differently. What a terrible tragedy, to lose the last of the pure-blooded ancients. Though not completely, would you like to see your mother? Albeit through the lens of one of my microscopes. Did you really think we'd leave such a precious specimen to rot in the gutter? We 
collected you're a freaking creep hair skin organs every fragment of every bone as breathtaking in death as in life as you my dear if Valna was elegance right down to her cellular structure And there it is, that same elegance. Oh, yes, time for yet another meeting. Sit tight, I won't be long. Here's the 63rd floor, where loyal Shinra employees relax and recharge. It's pretty late, but I bet people are still here dealing with the aftermath of Sector 7. It's their own damn fault. Stay focused. We need to find this guy. Yeah, yeah. Guess I better get working on my conversation skills. They look busy. The plate did just fall. What kind of particulates in the air? Seeing them like this somehow makes me feel a little bit better. Let's find our contact. Not seeing any security around. One less thing to worry about. Oh. Okay. Where are you, Mr. Collaborator? I think we just need to start talking to people who look the part. Remember, say mayor. If they say the best, then we have a winner. The hell's that? Combat sim. You can use it to train for battle in a virtual space. This training in that thing really makes it. You work here? I don't recognize you. Can I help you with something? The mayor. Is the best. I was told to expect you. You need access to upper floors, right? That's right. Before I trust you with this key card, I need to see what you can actually do. Say what? Do you know what would happen if you got caught? We're putting our lives on the line here. Prove you're worth it. We have a state-of-the-art combat simulator. It can provide a real challenge, let me tell you. If you beat the sim, then the key card is all yours. Well, well. You gonna call it quits? I'm ready for this. Bring it the hell on. Okay. Three person team versus Nair is the best. Wow. I'm gonna go normal. Cloud, the. Maybe that's if you come back here with four people. Again, go, go, go. Come on, just break already. Jeez, thank you. Not going to end well. Yep, okay. Okay, got it.
There we go. One down. Cure. Okay then. Okay, Dara, right blade. There we go. There we go, did it, nice. Key card. Here. This key card will grant you key card. to the 64th floor. You can use the elevator to get there. Once you're up there, just what is it you plan on doing? We came to get one of our friends. Taking ass and not taking names. She's being held in a research lab somewhere. A lab? Then she must be with Professor Hojo. It won't be easy to get to her. Access to R&D is limited to authorized personnel only. We'll find a way in. Know where we can find Hojo? A board meeting is scheduled to start soon. It's being held in the main conference room. President Shinra, Professor Hojo, and the other directors will be in attendance. Think they like surprises? We can even take the president as a hostage. Think of the leverage. Try it, and security will be on your asses in seconds. We need to find out what they're planning. So you want to spy in their meeting? Hmm. I have an idea. Head to the men's restroom. You can climb into the air ducts there. They go all the way to the conference room. Thanks for the tip. New content has been added to the Shinra Combat Simulator. You can win rewards only available there. Items cannot be used. I learned that the hard way. The HP and MP are slightly restored after each fight. Items cannot be stolen. Huh. I may be inclined to try that later. I'm curious, what, wait, can I claim the song is by it? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Uh oh. Cloud? Huh? You're Cloud, right? Uh, yeah. Holy shit! It's cool, bro. We went through training together. Damn. So you're still alive and kicking, huh? Some of the guys heard you got smoked, but I told them it was all bullshit. Hey, sit tight, man. I'm gonna go get Kunzel. I'll be right back. Old buddy. You okay? Yeah. But you were just... I'm good. Let's keep moving. I think we're all feeling it. Today we welcome there we go, finally found guest, it. Shinra's director of public security, who has an important message to share with us. <clears throat> Everyone here at Shinra is deeply saddened and outraged by this unconscionable act of terrorism. But at the same time, we will not be by threats or violence. To the people of Midgar, I make this vow. We will find the villains responsible and bring them to justice. Are you listening, Avalanche? You cowardly dogs! Run all you like. Shinra is coming. Do you think the other plates are in danger? Is it true that Wu Tai is gonna attack us? Did he get himself? Where do I go? Trust the narrative is intact? Rock solid. The people have embraced the Wu Tai Avalanche conspiracy wholeheartedly. I've almost come to believe it myself. Wu Tai's response? So far, nothing. 
And if those cowards do react, all the better for us and our story. Very well. Then we shall stay the course. If I may, sir, there was one other matter. Oh? A message from our man Palmer. Damn it! Barrett. Yeah, yeah, I know. We came here to save Eric. That's our first priority. That's right. We only get one chance. Hojo should be at that board meeting, so that'll buy us some time. We need to plan this just right. And ninth seems like the highest, so I'm gonna go to air. Also, it's 69th, so. God damn it. Fine. 64th, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's an up escalator. Got it. I mean, you can go down an up escalator if you if you try hard enough. And don't say you can't. I've tried it. I've done it. You you can get up. You can go up and down escalator and vice versa if you try hard enough. I'm not saying it's an ideal method. God damn it. I swear, you can do it. Do you think that's where Professor Hojo is? Where he should be. Huh? An important meeting is in session. Think I care? Can I help you? Yes, let me in. An important meeting is in session. Can I help you? I swear, I, I swear I want to slice her up. Little bit of recon. Need to find a way to infiltrate that room. You hear the words coming out of your mouth. We just gotta find that bathroom so we can get into the air duct. Ask anyone here. They can point us in the right direction. No thanks. We can find it on our own. Right here and men's room. All right. I'll wait out here. Huh? You can't hang out here. Tifa. It'd be better if you waited inside. Maybe, but this is... It's the men's room. Never mind. You're right. Oh, thank God. No one's in here. Love to show them what the ones down below look like. Come on. Let's just find that duct. I see it. Grappling hook! Gotcha. Or just use the toilet to prop ourselves up. If you want to do it the boring way. Look, I'm on guard duty. Right. So, can I go with you? Don't want to be here any longer than I have to. Yeah, sure. Just follow behind. Gotta be where we're listening in on them. I'm sure they're safe. But we live right by Sector 7, and I keep calling and calling, but I still can't get through. I heard that all the phone lines are dead. It doesn't mean anything. You sure? Pretty sure. And we may start two projects simultaneously, rebuilding the plate and the city. Members of the Urban Planning Division will likely take point on both. Director Tuesti has ordered teams to come up with three, five, and ten-year plans. Each team needs to come up with a detailed proposal and schedule. We're going to have to put a lot of man hours into this, so we'll need to start ASAP. Does anyone have any questions at all? If not, then we'll wait for the director to return. I'm telling you, I saw him! With my own eyes, sauntering down the corridor! We don't have time for this nonsense! Ah, he was as close to me as you are now. The, the shock of it made me spill my tea. Enough already. If there are intruders in the building, my men will deal with them. But, Mr. President, sir, I swear to you. 
Reeve. Sir, I have the damage assessment for Sector 7, and I'm afraid the figures are catastrophic. Spare us the doom and gloom. Uh, was there anything else? Uh, well, sir, I've also drafted a that reconstruction plan for... Huh? Not with the Ancient in our custody once more. Uh, with respect, sir, I don't see words, how... Two words, Reeve. <sighs> Neo Midgar. <sighs> in their promised land, we will build a new Mako-powered metropolis. Mr. President, we still don't know for sure that the promised land even... <sighs> Professor Hojo. The test results were within expectations. The specimen is somewhat lacking compared to her pure-blood mother, but for our purposes, she should more than suffice. So she can lead us to the promised land? Well, Mr. President, that remains to be seen. I would like your permission to secure her cooperation through more forceful means. Forceful, yet gentle. She is a precious resource that must be handled with care. Personally, I've never had a problem with torture. My armory is at your disposal. Why doesn't that surprise me? I had something more psychological in mind. Better to scar the psyche than mar the flesh. <laughs> I feel like the little one does naughty things in, in his free time. However... You will not make the same mistake twice. Is that clear? If I may, Mr. President, I have an idea how we might mitigate the risks. Simply put, we could have the ancient reproduce. In the absence of a second specimen, we would need to identify an alternative mate. I would start with candidates from Soldier. These would, of course, include S and G types. Quite frankly, there's no telling what kind of properties a crossbred specimen might possess. So, what say you all? <sighs> hmm. If there is nothing else... Mr. President! Meeting adjourned. Uh, please, sir! Stinks. Anything? The man in the lab coat. Head of R&D. We follow him. Okay. And then we kill the son of a bitch. Not until he's led us to Aerith. That's the plan. So I think this might be the perfect place to end off this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. You know what to do if you liked it. Uh, just com comment to talk to me and share it with people you think would like my Final Fantasy playthrough and just my stuff in general. Alright, uh, with that all said, I guess uh, all the stuff to say is I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.